and that's how you do the run. So you have your left hand playing G, A flat, and then you have C suspended 2 on your right hand. Hi, you're welcome to another Gospel Keys Easy Piano Tutorial. So here is another video to be added to the runs and arpeggios series. To watch other videos in this series, check out the link to the full playlist in the description box below. Before we get started, please do me a favor and please like this video. Thank you very much. All right, so in this episode of the runs slash arpeggios series, we are looking at run slash arpeggio for chord three. So let's start in the key of C. So I'll be looking at a few scenarios for chord three. So let's say we have a chord four to the three. So we have this type of chord three. So we have a suspended two, C suspended two over the E. So for this type of chord three, you can do your run arpeggio with one hand. Okay, so we've seen this type of run in this run series before, and here all you just need to do is just play just arpeggiate this chord really fast. Okay, so that's all you need to do for this chord three. Now let's say we have a seven, three, six chord progression. Okay, so you can do this chord 3 like this. So you can take this chord 3 and you can arpeggiate it or run it like this. So that's the chord. And that's how you do the run. So you have your left hand playing G, A flat, and then you have C suspended 2 on your right hand. Let's also try this in the key of C sharp. So there is my seven, three, and for your three you have just one note on your left hand, the five, Let's also try this in the key of F. So here we have left hand C and D flat. Also in the key of F sharp. So we have this notes. Let's go back to the key of C. So let's say we have this type of chord three. Let's say we have this.
So here we have this notes, D, and then we have the G major on my right hand. Also, we could do this. All right, before we get to the end of the tutorial, please do me a favor and like this video if you have learned one or two things from this tutorial. Also, please leave your thoughts in the comment section below. So we've come to the end of this tutorial. I want to say thank you very much for watching. Take care and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.